We prefer to look at the defined contribution model. It's really interesting, almost wherever you travel in the country, higher education, teacher, professors, are into a TIA CREF model, which is a defined contribution model. They love it. You don't, you never hear any complaints from higher ed over their pension system. It's amazing. But when you go down to K-12 and say, well, we want to modify this, you know, we want to have the K-12 teachers stop the defined benefit and go into the union screams, the union leaders scream. And, and I was in a, a National Conference State Legislators Summit on pensions. And we had someone there from the National Education Association. They said, NEA strongly opposes it. I said, well, could you tell me why then you offer it for headquarters employees? Why do the headquarters employees in the NEA have defined contributions? He said, well, that's different. It's different. What's different about it? But you can't, you can't expect the state and the taxpayers to assume 100% of the risk. You can't do that. 